Hey everyone, for those of you who have never met me before, let me introduce myself. Hi, my name is Marnie Goldberg. I'm known here on YouTube and around social media as Miss Gold Girl, and normally I'm here talking about makeup, clothing, fashion, that sort of thing. But this time of year, we're all talking about gifts and gift guides and holiday ideas. And while most of that centers around Christmas, I personally don't celebrate Christmas, I'm Jewish, and I do get a lot of questions about Hanukkah and Hanukkah themed gifts, Hanukkah themed decor. And I received a gift recently that just really got me excited about Hanukkah. And I initially just shared this on my Instagram stories and then I realized, let's make a video about this. Why not? So first of all, if you don't know anything about Hanukkah, I'm not gonna go into it on this video, but I did make a video a few years ago about it called What the Heck is Hanukkah? It's kind of a general overview without getting too much into the religious part of it just a basic kind of overview of what it is, how we celebrate it, at least here in the United States. And I will link that up in the I and down in the description box. And stay tuned for next week. I'm gonna do a little home tour of my holiday Hanukkah winter, also decor that is some of it you are seeing behind me and there's some of it sprinkled all throughout my house. So make sure you've subscribed and you hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on that one. But today I'm gonna to talk about just a few, I, I wanna say there's only eight, but I cheated, there's 14, Hanukkah-themed gift ideas or decor. If you personally celebrate Hanukkah, you're gonna love all of these. Maybe you don't celebrate Hanukkah, but you know someone who does, you've been invited to someone's home, you don't know what to give them. Now, I have a whole video and blog post on hostess gifts, that's great, but if you wanted something really specific to Hanukkah, I think I can help you out. So let's start with what's what inspired this whole video, and that is this box right here, it is from Sugar Fina. And you know, all of us have seen the advent calendars. I'm not talking about the religious ones, I'm talking about the fun commercialized ones that are filled with candy or the ones that I get excited about, beauty products, candles, all the fun things. I've never seen one for Hanukkah before. Now obviously, if you're celebrating Hanukkah, we're not celebrating Advent because the definition, as far as I know, of Advent is the countdown to the birth of baby Jesus. That's not what Hanukkah is. So in this case, it would be eight nights of opening up boxes. And that's what this calendar countdown is. You open up the box. It's a beautiful box. And for those of you who are asking, I did get a couple questions. This is kosher. It's dairy. Um, it has some dairy in it, but it's kosher with dairy. You open up this really nice box, and inside you have this beautiful menorah with eight boxes, and each night you pull out a box and there will be a candy treat inside. And when you put the box back in, the other side has a flame on it. So as the eight nights of Hanukkah progress, your menorah gets lit more and more until all eight nights are Fully lit, it's fun, yes, for children, of course, but you know what? I'm well past the age of child. I don't have any little ones in my house. My kids are 18 and 21, and I still think this is pretty awesome. So I'm really excited, and it's very affordable and a great hostess gift, gift for yourself or anyone who's celebrating Hanukkah. And if you're unfamiliar with how this works here on YouTube, everything is listed in the order in which I'm mentioning uh, in the description box where it says show more, click on that, and I'll have everything listed and links where you can shop them. The next thing is really something that's more for yourself, but I think anyone would be happy to receive this. I'm gonna insert some footage because mine is all set up on my mantle already, and that is a menorah. That is the traditional candle holder that we use to celebrate Hanukkah. Now this one is special because it is electric. Mine is quite a few years old, and you may notice that there is a light bulb missing. I actually found replacement light bulbs on Amazon and they are on their way. And I've only burned out one light bulb, and that's probably the one that's missing, is probably the first one that gets burned every night. I've had that for almost 10 years, and finally last year one burnt out. So it held up pretty well. The new one that I found on Amazon, the 20, maybe 18 version, is LED. So it's unlikely any of these are gonna burn out, possibly ever. But this is a very reasonably priced, under $50 on Amazon. It is a plug-in, it's not a USB or battery operated. So um, I have mine on an extension cord set on my mantle. It is absolutely beautiful. I mean, if you're talking about the festival of lights, which is what Hanukkah is, then this is a really great gift or a great piece to have in your home. And what I especially like is that I don't have to worry about setting fire to anything in my house if I forget to turn it off. Now, I do want to talk about this sweatshirt. Um, this is quite a few years old. This is from the brand Wild Fox. 
And this exact sweatshirt is no longer available. I'm sure you can find it if you search like on Amazon or one of those kind of sites, but um, this one is no longer current. And you know, this is very tongue in cheek, obviously. One holiday is not better than the other, but it's just a little, little dry humor that we like around this time of year. But Wild Fox does release holiday themed clothing, both for Christmas and for Hanukkah. And this year they have released two and I found them both at Nordstrom. One is a hoodie, which is great if you're into hoodies. And I will admit these are way up on the higher price range. They're over hundred dollars. This is not for everyone, but if it's something you're looking for, I wear mine every single year. So I'd say cost per wear. I'm getting my money's worth out of it. But um, so there's a really fun hoodie that looks a little more wintry at first glance. It's, it's blue and it's interspersed. Well, you're be seeing a picture of it, but it's interspersed with snowflakes and I think it's dreidels and Jewish stars. So at first glance, you might not be where you're looking at a Hanukkah hoodie, but the other one that I think is really cute. And again, we like our dry humor around here. It says it's a, just a gray sweatshirt. And what's nice about the wild Fox sweatshirts, admittedly, if you get over the sticker shock, they are not your average sweatshirt. They, I think you can see how it drapes. It's really thin yet. It keeps you warm. I don't know what magical properties they have. I also have a black, just a solid black one that wears like a sweater, but feels like a sweatshirt. Anyway, the Hanukkah sweatshirt this year um, available at Nordstrom is, it says everybody get lit or no, every day. Sorry. It's not quite that cheeky. Every day get lit in reference to each day we light a candle on the menorah and the actual menorah is gold foil. So there's a little bit of shine to it. I think it's so cute. So linking both of those below, they probably will also go on sale. I should say after the holidays, if you don't want it for this year and you're just willing to wait a couple more weeks, I would check Nordstrom site after Hanukkah's over. Just a thought. This next piece makes a great hostess gift. I leave this out during the holidays on my uh, kitchen counter. I'm having a party in a couple days and I will have sliced up lemons and limes sort of displayed on here for mixing drinks, but it's just your basic cutting board and it has a little um, Hanukkah menorah on the top. The one that I recently found is from Mud Pie. It's very similar. I kind of like that one better. It has a really beautiful sort of mother of pearl inlaid serving knife that goes with it. And the price point I especially love, it is under $30. So makes a really nice hostess gift, or you may want to keep it for yourself. Speaking of mud pie, a great site in general for finding really cute, affordable gifts or decor for your house. They also have some pretty pillows. I like having festive pillows on my couch in my family room. I actually have a pillow on display on an extra dining room chair here. I'm in my dining room. This one's from many, many years ago, but um, the one that I found at mud pie is really cute and it's just a festival of lights one has some embellishment on the um, Star of David that's in the middle. And again, it's under $30, I think it's 27. I'm gonna keep saying it. I'm gonna stop saying it. I'll say it one more time. Makes great gift, really nice for your own home. If you celebrate Hanukkah, I think it's beautiful. Since we are sitting in my dining room, let's talk about some things you can put on the table. And if you wanna see this dining room table, and I'm so excited about the table. I. I think it, I really hit it out of the park this year. That video, like I said, is coming up next week. There's not traditionally been a lot of really pretty stuff to put on a Hanukkah table. There's a lot of blue dishes, gold dishes, silver dishes, but specifically Hanukkah, not so much. Pottery Barn and William Sonoma are two retailers that have stepped up their game. And I just wanna highlight a couple of things. Pottery Barn specifically, William Sonoma has some stuff, I'll list it below, but the, the, the pieces that I am really excited about are from Pottery Barn. They have a whole line, it's a serving bowl, a serving platter, or, and, a set of four salad plates or accent plates. And I think they are stunning. They are just beautiful. It's a mosaic pattern. It, it's not specific to Hanukkah. I mean, they would work for any Jewish holiday you're celebrating, but obviously this time of year, we're going to be thinking of Hanukkah. And this is when they bring that stuff out. You're not going to find this in the stores um, any other time of year, except late November into December. So if you want um, a Jewish themed motif on your serving pieces or for accent pieces, this is the time of year to snatch them up. As of filming this video, they are on sale, but I have 
I'm not sure how long that sale's going on, so if the, when this goes up, that may be over. But at full price, they're still, I would say, reasonable. Especially the serving bowl, it's under $40, and it's beautiful. And I really like the salad plates. They are $60 for four of them. Which, that's full price, which isn't bad considering what they are. Back to Williams-Sonoma, this is edible, and you could place it, you know, like I would put it out here in my dining room if I didn't have an 80-pound Weimaraner that would eat it in a heartbeat. They have a fully decorated and assembled gingerbread house that is a Hanukkah house. It is adorable. It is a work of art. It would be a shame to eat it, but it is 100% edible and it will, what do I say, expire. It will go bad. So it is meant to be eaten. So admire it for a little bit if you happen to buy this and then eat it because as pretty as it is, if you don't eat it, it's gonna get moldy or whatever and poof. So beautiful and you can eat it. That could be, you know, put it out for display on the first night of Hanukkah, eat it on the last night of Hanukkah. Sticking with eating, a couple more things I wanna highlight. There are two things I found at Nordstrom of all places on their website. They're both edible. One is this beautiful display. Well, it's not a display. It's a beautiful box of handcrafted artisan chocolates. They're stunning. There's a box of nine that I think it's $48. And then there's a smaller box that's obviously less. They're gorgeous. I assume that they are delicious as well. It has good reviews, but just to look at, if you were to come to someone's home and present that, I think whoever's receiving it would be very happy to take that off your hands. And then for a much different price point, but also at Nordstrom, it is a dreidel. I'm pretty sure it's from Dylan's Candy Bar. I could be wrong. Um, there'll be something across the screen if I am, but it's a pack of two. There are two of these in the order for $40, and it's a pretty good size dreidel and it's filled with a variety of Hanukkah themed candies and I think I, again it's super cute the packaging is what you know you're paying for and it's unique in that there aren't a lot of Hanukkah options out there that aren't frankly kind of cheesy so I think this is really I'm gonna say cute again I need a new word for that it's adorable and then the last thing I want to mention found it online at Target this is definitely geared for someone who has young children it's a similar concept, again, to the advent calendar. It is, I don't even know what to call it. You're gonna see a picture of it over there. It's a punch-through box. So it's a box that has eight compartments, and, as, and you choose what you wanna put in it, whether it's food items, little, little trinkets, little goodies, what have you, money, I don't know. I guess if it were an adult-themed one, you could put little, little airplane-sized bottles of alcohol, whatever you wanna put in there. And, each, and then you put the cover on, and then each night, the children ideally, or whomever is celebrating Hanukkah, punches through that tissue paper for that night and pulls out with the prize or the, whatever it is for that designated evening. And like I said, there's eight compartments. I think it's a really cool idea. I've never seen anything quite like it. And I like that it's, it's an empty box because then you can choose what to put in it. Because oftentimes when you buy these pre-filled things, the stuff you get in there is kind of junky and nobody really wants it. And I think this is definitely reusable. I'm not sure that it's meant to be, but you could easily pull off the remnants of the tissue paper, buy new tissue paper, and tape it back on. It's only 10 bucks, so it's not a major investment if you wanna buy a new one every year, but I think this is a great idea. So that's just a starting point, just a first glance. Um, some really, I think, nice, not junky, not tacky, things that are beautiful and would be very much appreciated if they are received as gifts or that you might wanna keep for yourself to decorate your home and celebrate in your own home. But there are, there are more options, I'm, I'm still looking. So that's where you come in. I would love to hear from any of you. If you've been cruising the internet or you've seen something in a store that you think we need to know about because the resources just aren't there as main for mainstream. It's just hard to find. If you found some beautiful Hanukkah themed decorations or Hanukkah themed gifts, you know, hostess gift type things, please let us all know about them in the comments below, specifically like where the actual store, if you've got a link, that would be even better. Spread, spread the knowledge, help us out because there's just not a lot out there for all of us who like to decorate this time of year and don't want it necessarily Christmas oriented. So thank you very much. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. Don't forget to read the blog post. Everything is written down for you in the description box there and will also be listed in the um, over on the blog if you want to go back there for reference and don't want to listen to me babbling on. As always, thank you so much for choosing to spend some of your time with me and I will see you in the next video. Bye!